it is a federal statistic, not mine, it's not my opinion, that one out of five children, children, before or reaching the age of 18, has been exposed to something that has met a degree of criminal prosecutability, not just something that would make a parent upset. And this is our government's federal statistics. These come out every four years. They are not mentioned. I do not know why. But here's the deal. There's nobody between those kids and what's happening to them other than you. There's no one who has a hat whose job it is. The people who gather the statistics, our federal government, also gather statistics on how much salad they're eating and a bunch of other things. That's what's published. This statistic has been out there for a decade. I wrote about it 15 years ago. I'm not the only one. I don't want to discuss this statistic. That's not why I'm here. It is one out of five. You can look it up. So whose job is it? You are the only ones who can do anything. Okay. First off, how can you do it? It's not your job. Who's going to let you? And what can be done? Triage. You can find out what the numbers are. For our students, quarter million students, real numbers. It's called anonymous polling. If it costs a million dollars, I could ask you for a million dollars and you'd be all impressed and give it to me. It involves a penny. You flip a penny. You ask the students. You tell them. If it's heads, you say yes. If it's tails, you answer the question. I had planned on giving you each a penny and inquiring as to whether your favorite pie was apple or pumpkin. It's a big